Hello, Joel Blessed here at Spire Hope Outreach is underway here in Denver, Colorado. What a day we've been having. What a morning we've been having. Praise God, we've been praying for tons of people, loving our people, blessing people. We have such a great team of volunteers out here. We've got Tanisha, Deborah, Pastor Rick, Lori, my sister Jenna just pulled up with Angel, my brother Arthur, myself. Wow, so great, but the need is so great. As you can see behind me, we're, we're working and loving and blessing those around us. Such an amazing day. Um, we're active, we're on the streets. God is good. I'm gonna turn the camera around, let you see what we got going on. Here we are, Havana and Colfax. Blessing people today. Our wonderful team, more people showing up to help, to minister, to care. Pastor Rick, I'm on Facebook Live, is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. It's Pastor Rick Carter. Hello, everybody. Why what are we doing here? Why are you out here today? Well, what brings you to the streets? I think for the most part, man, it's, um, it's got to be about a love for people yeah. and a heart to see them um, get their needs met. Yes. That's mentally. There's a lot of mental health issues down on the street. Yes. A ton of them um, that the city doesn't address appropriately, NARC and the state. Right. So oftentimes it falls on the church. Right. So we're here to maybe help to speak to people, spend a little time with them. Um, we actually also just had the chief of police, wow. <laughs> uh, Chief Vanessa down here, and she's just walking the streets as well. Wow. So we're helping to just move the heart of people towards Jesus. Amen. And the more we see in or, um, the more we see institutions and churches like Inspire Church, which is your church, <laughs> it right? It is, yes. Um, and I know it's not about the church no. name for you, right? But I just want to say that because sometimes people will be watching and they'll forget the name of the church, but they'll remember you and me. Right, right. You know? So I think it's important to know Inspire Church is doing a lot of great things Amen. for Thank Jesus you. Christ. So that's kind of why I'm out here. Did that answer your question? Yes, and I, I thank you for your heart, okay. for your community, and those in, and people in need. Thank you. Absolutely, I, I, man. I greatly appreciate it. Absolutely. You. Thank you. All right, man. Amen. So, Pastor Rick Carter, man, he what a great man. He's out here helping us today. There's a, uh, I'll turn the camera. Tanisha, Arthur, say hello. Hi. Our wonderful team. Y'all out here today in the heat. Yes. Got us a little shade, but praise God. Amen. So we all Thank you. seven days a week in the heat. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for your heart to serve. Yes. It means a lot. We are blessed to be a blessing. That's right. Amen. <laughs> so as the buses roll up, we have uh, free food and water, snack over here if you would like something. Yeah, come on over. Um, as the buses pull up, as you can see behind me, right over here, we invite people to come on over. We give them a physical, you know, need, cover some toiletries, whatever they may need. But praise God that we ask them, can we pray for you? And boy, the prayer has been going on today, hot and heavy. And so I just wanted to come live today, let you see where we are, what we're doing, and how we're taking care of our community and those in need and, and I want to encourage you to maybe find a spot in your neighborhood that has a couple has some needs going on and share with them love them care for them okay. we just showed up with a bottle of water and some snacks one day and God has you know guided us and blessed us along the way and provided such a wonderful team of people you're our team too no matter where you are in the United States your love your prayer for our ministry means the world your donations financial or through snacks and clothing whatever it is that makes us a makes us able to do these things so i'll go ahead and turn the camera around again here real quick let you see where we are inspire hope outreach is underway amen our wonderful team pastor rick is over here witnessing the people at the bus stop Amen. Hey, ladies, girls, my wonderful nieces and friends. 
Why do you all do this? Why do you come out here at such a young age? Um, I was just raised that way and I like to spread Jesus around and let people know that he's here and he loves you. Yeah. Um, to help them to make sure they have a hope. They just feel safe. Well, I want to thank you guys for being out here today. I know you could be sleeping in. <laughs> Bye, Tanisha. Love you. Thank you. Watch your step. All right. So we're live out here. My sister Jenna just showed up. You know, we're going to get working out here. Such a great day. Such an honor to share the love of Jesus with those in need. Here we have our, where we are, there's the cannabis store across the street. We got Little Caesars, Poco de Canti, and then we got 7-Eleven and us. Right over here, we have our need prayer sign. Lori. Yes, We're live on Facebook. I hope that's okay. okay that's perfectly okay. What, what, what brings you out to the streets? Why, why do you do what you do? I just want to give back what God has given me. Amen. I just want to reach out and hopefully make somebody's day and yeah. maybe pull closer to God. Amen. I appreciate your heart for sharing the love of Jesus with those in our community. Yes. Yeah. Thank you for having us. Amen. Anytime. <laughs> we need you. <laughs> Amen. So here's our table. We had some somebody bring us some noodles, some ramen, some different things like that. Hey, girls, y'all want to get some bags out and put them on the table here? And we have our little sign that it kind of explains to people as we drive by what's going on. And, our, of course, our honk for Jesus uh, sign. Anyway, oh, look, at ice water. We need it. It's about 90 degrees out here right now. Yeah. And Pastor Rick and Lori put together these crosses that people can take with them. Amen. So wonderful. All right, I'm going to get busy. We're having a great day out here. It's just a wonderful way to spend a Saturday. What better way to spend a Saturday than sharing the love of Jesus with those in need? You see, this area that we're in, is, it's, it's an eating community. Um, there are homeless, there are, but it's a lot of people going to work, going to their jobs, walking around, going to the stores, and we are here sharing Jesus with them. Downtown on our third Saturday of the month, we'll be down at Civic Center Park where it's a lot of homeless. We're providing a lot of clothes, and coverings, and things like that. This one is about love. It's about prayer, about sharing Jesus. And we've had so many people get led to Christ right here on the street corner. I love you. God bless you. I'll turn the camera on one more time, let you see where we are before we I get busy. I know that y'all have neighborhoods in your city that could use a little something like this to share love, to talk to others, to ask them if they want prayer. Most people say no, but there are the few that say yes. God bless you. I love you. Just wanted to come quick and say we're on the streets, we're active, and we're serving our community, and most importantly, we're sharing the love of Jesus with those in need. Love you. Bye-bye.